hi all welcome back to the channel so today in this video I'll be covering a new topic so it's how we can remove a focus from an element so there is a method called um, I think locator dot focus so what it does it actually focuses the element let's say there is input box and you, int, you want to enter something in that input box so what you do you to make it focus let's say from the keyboard or from the mouse you just hover over it right or just click on that button or input box right so let's let me give you example so let me uh, right now let me refresh this google page so you can see uh, the focus is currently in the search box directly automatically so you do not have to click on it right so instead when, when you just uh, like click on the refresh button it's automatically coming so you can write something like pl something so it you just directly click uh, in uh, typing the um, you're typing your from your keyboard you are just typing it right so you do not have to uh, select the mouse here and then you are typing not you're not doing that so this is called autofocus I mean it's automatically focusing here now for example if I clicking outside of this particular here I mean in this blank space I'm just clicking on it so let me click here so now if I type try to type something so you can see it's not typing I mean you, you, you're not able to see anything but I'm typing here so what happens like the focus is removed now so manually we are doing it so how do we do it how you can do it auto through automation right so if the same steps you have to do through automation so how do you perform that so let's uh, understand that using this locator dot blur method okay so this is newly introduced in playwright version 1 dot I think 27 or 28 I think 28 1.28 probably I don't remember but we can check it in the documents so here in the release note if you go there you can see new APIs which is located dot blur so this is I think introduced in 1.28 version so let's let's see a demo on that so let me create a file first so test uh, blur or, remove, or you can write like test to remove focus and uh, let's um, copy this part and let's copy the URL and paste it here okay so now what next so next uh, we have to identify this locator so as you can see I can take any locator I mean uh, we can use like page dot um, and there is a get by let's say get by title is there any title is available yes search is available so I can just use that get by title so what is this this is search box or search input right so here we are doing search input uh, dot fill uh, what what we are filling we are filling something like uh, playwright okay now if I if I execute this scenario it will it will execute it directly so but what is what is the problem here problem like here uh, we are actually giving the search input directly so you are saying like hey playwright you just go and find search input and in that search input you just fill with this playwright text so that's why let's say even though it is not focus then also it will focus it and enter it okay but what we want we want actually directly it should what we did we just refresh the button I refresh this I'm, I'm refreshing this Google page and what we did we didn't click anywhere right we just directly typing it here so we and we know right it's already focused so the same thing we can do without using search input so what we have to do here and uh, let me uh, comment out it first and uh, let me do page dot keyboard dot 
press and here you need to write let's say here it will press some key okay it can be anything so first I'm pressing P okay then it will press P and then let's say I need to press playwright completely so what we have to do you have to just uh, do these things I mean I'm just writing play or we, I'm just press I'm, I just want to type play okay that's what I want to type so keyboard dot press P L A Y so what I wanted to uh, explain here like uh, once we do it it will automatically enter this P L A Y here in this text input but how it is entering this input right so that's that's why I mean it is already focused that's why it's able to enter it directly if it is not focused then it would not be able to enter it so let's run this scenario and let's see what is happening and let me give one uh, delay as well so page dot wait for timeout so pi test minus is that's that's headed and here we need to give miscellaneous and test remove focus so it is launching google.com now you can see the PLAY it's entered right and the test passed so we are able to see like even though I'm not mentioning the locator search input it's still entering PLAY in the search input box okay now what happens if we try to remove now what was the what was the scenario that we perform manually so first we wanted to type something here okay then we clicked here outside of it so that means we are removing the focus then we wanted to type something and it should not type here right so that's the scenario I want to complete with uh, playwright right so let's do that so now once we enter this word after that what we'll do we will do uh, now this time we need the locator okay I think if I use page dot focus it is, is it available let me check page dot blur no page dot blur is not there so what we need to do we need this now search input so the search input so we know already know like right, uh, the search input I mean the focus is there in the search input right so what we have to do search input dot blur that's it so this will remove the focus from the search input box and now let's say I want to type this word again this let's say this time I want to write different maybe I can want to write like uh, W R I T G H anything I mean I'm just trying to write uh, play right but it's okay W R I uh, W R G H okay so this word I want to uh, this key press I want to press these keys so from the keyboard so it's just like you are pressing virtually from the keyboard so it's just emulating your accents okay now uh, now what I want to do I want to let's say I want to validate whether uh, my validation should be like it should still show me I mean if I try to get this value I mean if I have to fetch this value from this input text input box whatever value is there then that should be only play okay so what how can I do it so search input dot um, get input value or I think there is a method called input value yeah so this will fetch me uh, the value so value is this so now I can use expect keyword so expect or di I do not need it actually so I can print it directly so print um, value and also I can give a expect keyword so I'm doing the assertion so expect search input uh, dot to have uh, value 
so what value I'm expecting I'm expecting the value play right so if I'm expecting the value play P L A Y and W R G H then that's wrong I mean uh, expected should be um, like play should be the expected results now if there is any bug in the application then what would happen then this uh, this would not be unfocused right or focus will not be removed so in that case after play uh, this four uh, four characters would be typed right so let's see what happens now So as you can see the focus was removed and after that uh, it was trying to enter this characters w r g h and then it uh, get this input value so input value was i think plays this was the input value that we entered first time play but uh, if if the focus was not removed in that case it would have uh, it would have fetched the complete uh, word like play and then w r w r g h okay so uh, application is correctly working because that's what we expected like it should happen manually also this is happening and uh, now it's also happening so if you have any application where you need to um, do this kind of scenario then you can use this approach to do that uh, i hope it's clear and, and that's how we can use this um, search input dot blur or locator dot blur method to remove focus from an element so thank you for watching if you like the video please like and share with your friends thank you for watching again bye